We often hear people looking back at their lives with fondness and uttering the words, back in the day, followed by something you absolutely don't want to hear. So, what actually happened back in the day? 100 years ago, the life expectancy for men at birth was at 47 years. Today, it's at 79, and it's only increasing with the advancement of technology. And speaking of technology, back then, only 14% of all homes had a bathtub, and most women only washed their hair once a month, using egg yolks for shampoo. Back in the day, smoking was considered okay, and people were used to eating in smoke-filled restaurants, working in smoke-filled offices, and people were even allowed to smoke inside hospitals. As for cities, they were small, slow, and dirty, with the tallest building in the world being the Eiffel Tower, standing at just 300 meters tall. That's less than half the height of the current Burj Khalifa, and the maximum speed limit in most cities was 10 miles per hour. Discrimination against minorities was the norm, with segregation not being outlawed in the United States until the Civil Rights Act of 1964. And it wasn't just against people of color. Homosexuality was a crime in most of Europe in 1915, and Canada even once passed a law prohibiting poor people from entering the country for any reason. Despite the abolishment of slavery in 1865, less than a hundred years ago, many black people were still living in very bad conditions, not much better off than slaves. They lived in their own neighborhoods and went to their own schools, Black men could even get lynched if they looked at a white woman wrong back then. Overall, education by today's standards was barely existent a hundred years ago, with only 6% of all Americans being high school graduates, and 2 out of 10 adults were unable to read or write. Even doctors! 90% of them had no college education, and 95% of all women had a home birth, compared to less than 2% today. Even with the recent rise of ISIS, we're still living in the most peaceful time in history. Whether this will change in the future is yet to be seen.